Okay, so this video is an explanation of the assignment and the contest. Um, we are going to do an Among Us photography contest. So it's going to require art, and photography is another form of art. So um, let me explain the assignment to you. So I've listed all these things in your Google Classroom as well. But um, the assignment is, let's see if I can blow this up. I don't know that I can, so we'll, hopefully you can see it. Um, first of all, you're going to create your own Among Us characters out of cut paper. And I've made a video that shows you how to do that. Okay, so that is attached down below. So watch that in a little bit. Then you can create accessories for your characters if you want. You don't have to like the crown or the little pet that sits on their head or the different hats or all those things. You can create those if you want to. You don't have to. Um, then you're going to create a scene for your character to be in. And that scene can be created from other pieces of cut paper and real life things. And hopefully when I show you the pictures, that will make sense. Um, your photo must fall into one of the following scenes, either A, a scene that could appear in the Among Us game. So I asked my daughter and she said that like, there's a lot of different tasks you do in the Among Us game. Or if you played it, um, you'll know. If you haven't played it, look up Among Us tasks in Google and look at the images and you'll see some of the different things they could do. Um, so one of them has to be a, that a scene that could be from the game. And then the second one is a creative scene that would probably never happen in the game, but you're just having fun with, with these little characters. And I'll show you two examples, one for each one of those categories. Um, then you will take a photo of your scene using only your Chromebook. That way it's equal and fair for everybody because we all have the same tool that we're using. So I want you to think about your composition, which is how you frame it, how it fills the page. I want you to think about your lighting and your perspective that you take it at, your angles. Um, I will do a video on all that, talking about how to edit it and how to do your different angles. Um, and you'll see that down below as well. Um, so I have three different videos. One um, to show you how to do the cut paper character. One, to show you how the idea about making the scenes and how to make your scenes, that's lesson two. And then the third one about how to take your pictures and how to edit them. Okay, these are all due on Monday, November 23rd at noon. Okay, you can enter as many as you would like, but you have to enter one in each category. And you have to keep working on these until the deadline. So you can't just do one in each category and go, oh, I'm done. You're going to keep making scenes until the deadline, okay, during art class. Um, you may bring things from home to use in your photos, but these items have to be small. They have to fit in the palm of your hand. You may also take pictures at home if you want, like make additional characters at home and do them at, at home if you want, but you still have to take your pictures on your Chromebook. And um, doing a picture at home does not mean you don't have to work on it during class. So that can just be additional ones if you want to submit a bunch of them. Um, to submit them on here on um, Google Classroom, there's an assignment that says um, creative scene and one that says game scene. You will take your photo and you'll attach it to that final assignment. If you can't figure out how to just attach, attach the photo, make a Google Doc and put your photo inside the Google Doc and then submit that. And you can make one Google Doc for all your creative submissions and then one Google Doc for all your game submissions if you need to do that, okay? If you have questions with figuring out how to submit them, email me, I put my email on the bottom of this. Let me show you a couple I took. So here is the one I took for an end task. So one of the tasks is to water plants. So I had a little mini cactus. I took the little mini cactus, I put it in front of a plain colored background you could also just set a piece of plain paper behind it. You don't want a lot of things going on in your background in your composition. I found a little thing for him to stand on that I had just laying around and I put my little character on there. And in the video on making the scenes, I'll show you how I got him to stand up. Okay, and this is his first one. So this is him in the scene of watering the plants. This is his task he could do in the game. Then I did a couple multiple pictures of the same scene here for would be a creative scene. So he's digging in the sugar bowl. Okay, I'll talk about the different angles and perspectives. See how I took it a lot of different ways. I'll talk about doing that um, in that third video where we talk about editing and how to take your photos. But there you go. That is a creative scene. Um, 
then do one that is a scene from the game. Okay, hopefully this makes sense. You understand the assignment. If you don't, please send me an email and I hope you guys have a lot of fun with this. The winner will, re will receive a large candy bar from me and the winner in each category. There'll be one winner, a winner for the most creative and for the best game scene um, from each category. And I'll have some other people help me judge that as well. So good luck. I hope you have fun with this assignment.